Developments in a story we first brought you last night at 6. An alligator spotted in the Blackstone River in Woonsocket is now in the hands of a reptile specialist. The gator was picked up earlier today after one man never gave up catching the reptile. It is our top local story at 5.30. Highway to News reporter Naked Uosu is live in our newsroom with more. Well, Mike, the specialist who picked up the reptile says last night was way too cold for the alligator to be outside. So not only did that Woonsocket man rescue the animal, he may have saved its life. Trevor Bowman says goodbye to the alligator he rescued from the Blackstone River. He says he bonded with the reptile, but he still slept with one eye open. Slept down the couch just in case. <laughs> it was fun. Got loose? Yeah, but uh, uh, yeah, I feel good. When state officials told him the gator would not survive the winter, Bowman took matters into his own hands. Wednesday, he and his friend Caitlin watched the gator in the water near the Allen Street lofts in Woonsocket. Eventually, they were able to rope it in with a computer cord. But when I snared him with my USB cord thing, <laughs> he, uh, he obviously freaked out, but then in the cooler, he kind of cooled off and and uh, well warmed up really. He kept it warm and fed the gator chicken until a reptile specialist arrived Thursday afternoon. The alligator doesn't have a permanent home just yet, but Bowman was assured his new friend will be safe. He says because he's a little guy, he'd be easier to, to put somewhere actual that could get some joy out of him or something, but I think it's a happy ending. And we're told that the specialist says that colleges have expressed interest in the reptile, saying that they will not be using the reptile for dissection, possibly just using it with science students studying reptiles. Live in the newsroom, I'm Neka Nwosu, Eyewitness News.